I'm stranded slowly on this talking road Just waiting on the sun to rise I'm stranded slowly on this talking road Just waiting for another try Open up the sky so I can breathe again Open up my eyes so I can see again Cause ever since you left It's never been the same Through the smoke I see you wandering like I've never seen you before Looking lost like a child who's never ever been here before Through the smoke I know you're miles away from Chicago to LA I go up here in the night
Hello everyone, welcome to Zhuzhang Oceanarium. We finally bought a like first exhibit with animals in. So the entrance and it's the big old exhibit yeah full with different sea fowl and also some waterfowl. So yeah, I kinda got inspired by uh, the Oceanographic Valencia in Spain. Because they have like a big kind of central, I don't know how to describe, central like water exhibit. I don't know, a waterfowl exhibit there in the middle. Also with flamingos and pelicans and cormorants and other ducks and such. I kind of stole that idea from them to have like a big, have like big open water thing in the middle and then have aquariums on the side. So I think on this side, we'll focus more on fresh water. On the other side, of this exhibit will be marine. But anyway, let's take a look at our exhibit. So we have several black cormorants in this exhibit. There's one over here. We've got some pelicans. Obviously the logo of the oceanarium. Another cormorant sleeping there. We've got like a big old flock of greater flamingos. And we have some mandarin duck somewhere floating about. We also have this Indian spotted bald whistling duck. Oh, Indian spot bald duck, not whistling duck, sorry. Also some swans around and now there's the mandarin ducks. I think we have five of these mandarin ducks. And I'm not sure. There's one of the swans. So yeah, that's all the birds in this enclosure. So we have two swans, cormorants, spot bull ducks, mandarin ducks, flamingos, and white pelicans. So let's take a walk around, shall we? And this building over here, like I said, I was going to focus more on filter, like backstage areas and stuff in this aquarium. So this is a big old filter building for this tank and not tank um this exhibit which has a large water feature so obviously it would need to be filtered the water the birds will be pooping in there and all the business and stuff so i just made this little thing here so you can kind of peek into the filter room as all the pipes and such different modules if you go in there, it's not an actual filter room, it's just a bunch of poles and yeah, a lot of this is empty, but it's just to kind of get the concept across. Probably build a lot, a few more of these. Let's make it a bit more realistic, which I like. Here's the sort of med bay area, the staff come in. It's not different to anything else, really, Zoo Tycoon. I did add a bit of a staff bathroom. Go inside, full sink, full toilet. Yeah, same as everything else. Have this large open space so, like, if you want to transport birds in and out of this place or get vehicles in, we can do that here. This little uh, holding pen, so I don't know if any of the birds are nesting, we could maybe hold them in here. I'm sure later when I build more backstage areas. We'll have more holding pens for the birds. Let's go see the actual exhibit. So have these flamingos. I mean, realistically, they'd all congregate in the same area, but this is Sioux Tycoon, so they kind of all over the place. And walking through rocks and flying when they shouldn't be. I thought this exhibit came out nice. Got this little. It's kind of inspired by Lukoshi using these um, poles as a barrier. And then putting these ground covers to hide the cliff. I like that. And we've got rocks for them to perch on. Can't do that because Zoo Tycoon is, but it's the concept there. 
Oh, and also put these little kind of wood things to separate the dirt. So this is like a bit more of a clay substance. So if flamingos want to build nests, they can. And this would be a bit more sand or concrete slope, almost. So I think you'll notice that most of these animals are actually Chinese animals. So greater cormorants, the pelicans, the all the ducks are found in China, which makes sense because this aquarium is based in China. So if you are giving animal suggestions, I'd prefer you to suggest Chinese animals, preferably. But I'm sure we'll have a few more exotic species, but I want to keep it more Chinese, like this big old exhibit, waterfowl exhibit here. So that's it for today, and I think I'll see you in the next one. Bye!